Hello, hello, we got Kenny Evans here, another car video. And the title of this video is, Can You Get Women and Be On Your Purpose at the Same Time? It's a very, very, very popular topic of discussion in the manosphere. You know, and um, a lot of guys believe you gotta focus on your purpose first before you attempt or even think about getting women. So you could actually have more stability and, you know, so you're not so needy and women feel that energy, especially when you've actually accomplished your goal, you know. So it is uh, interesting and um, I understand where the people come from, you know, um, but I believe uh, being on your purpose and getting women are not mutually exclusive. They could come together as one you know it just depends on how you design your life you know because according to how you design your life both of those things in your life will be fruitful and they will multiply you know so it is all very simple it's all very easy you just have to make a plan you know so um really when it comes to the whole being on your purpose it's very simple. You could be on your purpose. And then in the meantime, going through life, if you see a woman, go get her. Excuse me, whether you're at the gas station, you see an attractive woman, go approach her. You're at the, the mall, you see an attractive woman, go approach her. <laughs> you know, you're at the grocery store. You see an attractive woman, go approach her. And still, you will be on your purpose because all those places I mentioned, you know, maybe besides the mall, are places you will have to go. So it's not really taking time out of your day or your life to approach women. It doesn't have to be this big thing you know, where you have to set out whole days or weeks or a week and you have to do a certain amount throughout, you know, um, a week. And sure, some people will tell you, hey, you should approach 25 women a day or you should t cut out this amount of time to approach women. And there's nothing wrong with that. But at the same time, you don't have to do that. You just, and usually they say that for beginners, people who are just not getting started really learning and wanting to understand women in the game, you know, but there's just many ways to skin a cat. So there's no right way or wrong way necessarily to get women and still be on your purpose. You know, you don't even have to dedicate any time to women if you don't want to. There's nothing wrong with that too. You know, and if, you know, there's women who come by, hey, cool. Or if they want you, and of course it's going to be rare. And if you want them, bam, you know, or you could focus on your purpose Monday through Friday. Set out the weekends, you know, to, to get the women you want. Or even if you want to work on your purpose during the weekends, maybe the weekends at nighttime, you can focus on getting women. I mean, it's all up to you. It's your life. <laughs> you live it on your terms and you direct it on your terms. There's nothing wrong with that. You know, but the main thing I don't like when it comes to these guys who talk about purpose, at least in the beginning, meaning that, you know, oh, they feel like that's what you got to do. That's what you got to do. They don't think about life in the grand picture. Just focus, focus on your purpose, focus on your purpose. A lot of them do it because, again, they believe they will be able to focus on the women women will not find them as needy and therefore they feel if they're not needy then the women will be more needy and constantly be focused on them and running after them and chasing them and then whenever they get established making money get cars get a own place 
then women will really be flocking to them. But the problem with that is you're attracting gold diggers. You know? And if a woman is really turned on by the fact that you don't give them attention, you know, she's probably really insecure. You, I mean, and there's nothing wrong with that. You want a woman, you always want women to be a little bit insecure because then they're always going to see you as the prize. But depending on how far you go and you swing that pendulum, you're going to get that same opposite on the opposite end. So if you're really insecure, the women you're attracted to be really insecure. And that's going to be drama in your life. You know? But ultimately, the problem I have with a lot of these guys who talk about being on your purpose, being on your purpose, they're doing it because they want women. They're not on their purpose for them. Their purpose. <laughs> the irony. Your purpose is supposed to be something that you feel so passionate about or that you really enjoy. And it's something that you give to the world to bring value. It has nothing to do with women. Whether you attract zero women with it or you attract a million women with it, you still have that same passion and enjoyment for it. And no matter what goes on in the world, that is something you will be doing for the rest of your life. True focus on your purpose. It's not, oh, this thing is going to help me get a lot of women, so I'm going to do it. But then when it doesn't actually turn out, you are attracting women with this, then you're going to switch to something else and then something else, something else. That is not how it works. A man on his purpose is on his purpose regardless of what happens in life. He's steady. And that steadiness, if you want to talk about anything that will attract a woman when it comes to your purpose, that steadiness is what will attract a woman because she sees you're focused. And women love a guy with ambition. Because they have the opportunity to um, make a lot of money. Because of that ambition, they have drive, they have focus. And that is what attracts women to that kind of man who is on his purpose, but yet isn't really giving them that much attention. As long as they're genuinely on their purpose and not attempting to ignore a woman to get her to chase them. Because eventually you will get found out. And that is what weak men do. Insecure men do. But if you are generally focused on your purpose. Because you really have passion and enjoyment of it. Women will feel that energy and they will flock to you. But it has to be genuine. It can't be fake. You know so. I mean the whole purpose thing. It has a place. It does. But I believe. A lot of guys who talk about it, they talk about it for the wrong reasons. Because, again, they're putting women on a pedestal. And that's their way of acting like, oh, I don't really care about women. And acting like they're not putting them on the pedestal. But in reality, they are because they're focusing on their purpose to get more women. You know, so that is definitely um, something you don't want to be doing. And we always got to realize that as men... We live life on our terms. And your purpose is supposed to be on your terms. And getting women is supposed to be on your terms. So if you're doing something or you're mixing like that, talking about you're on your purpose, but it's really to get women, it's not on your terms. It's on the woman's terms. So you don't want to be that guy. Because it doesn't make you look good and it makes you look weak and insecure. And other guys who are real men, strong, confident, alpha men, select men, shout out to Ron Wills, they'll see it. And confident, strong, you know, alpha females, select females, they'll see it too. You know, so you gotta be you gotta be who you are and focus. 
on your purpose because of you and get women when you want to. There's nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. So, um, that's all I got for y'all here today. If you enjoy the video, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button so you get notified whenever I make some uh, new videos, upload some new videos. And let me know in the comments uh, what other topics you'd like me to talk about in relation to dating and relationships. Let me know. I'm interested. And I'm, I'm up for the challenge. And of course, if you found value in these videos, definitely don't uh, hesitate to donate. You know, I appreciate any donation from a dollar to a million dollars. You know what I mean? It's no sweat off my back. As long as you found value and enjoyed the video or the videos. So that's all I got for y'all today. And until next week, be safe. And I'll see y'all then. Peace.